All right, this is a uh, starting point video. This is a 1980 Z28 Camaro. This has actually been my car uh, since 2005. So about uh, 15 years, I guess 2004, so 16 years. Anyway, um, been neglected, obviously. So this is kind of the, uh, the video just showing kind of the state of the vehicle as it is right now. I just got it over here. Uh, the garage obviously is a work in progress too. It's a small two car garage. And uh, we're just gonna start kind of a three phase little restoration. Um, the first phase, this car is actually running right now. It's got a small block Chevy 350 motor. I got an Edelbrock 750 on there. A uh, high rise intake performer manifold from Edelbrock. Uh, heads with 202 valves, headers, um, and it's got a cam in it. It actually runs uh, pretty good. The uh, carb's a little big with uh, being a 750. We're at altitude here in Denver, Colorado, so probably have to rejet that. Um, I want to fix this paint, uh, even just kind of a, you know, a rattle can uh, solution for now, and then. Uh, I think the end goal is I'll actually vinyl wrap this thing when it's all said and done. But kind of wanted to show a prelim video, kind of a before, and I'm going to be doing a lot of projects. Uh, I got a new grill coming in right away, so that'll be one of the first things on that. And obviously some of the paints fading. I got some more of that kind of paint cancer there. But overall, this car is super clean. Uh, like I said, runs pretty good. One of the other cool things about it is it is a manual. It's got a uh, Richmond Super T10 tranny in it and uh, super fun car. So really excited to finally get it here at the house. And we're gonna start kind of tearing into a little bit, the plans to get it registered and running. Right now the exhaust just goes from these headers straight to glass packs it's a little bit too too loud for the residential area that i'm at but uh we're uh we're working through it we'll see see what we can do to make this thing uh kind of run as a good daily driver and i don't know get get it start ripping again thanks